Hey everyone, I'm here with Abby, and we're gonna what talk. Up? We're gonna talk a little bit about this concept of agent networks or agents working together, multiple agents to accomplish a task. Yeah, and we got these cool mics now too, which is dope. The production quality is going up. This is an interesting topic because this is kind of agent networks in general are multi-agent systems where the agents are working together and they're kind of working together autonomously. When you think of like a Tesla or a Waymo self-driving and it's kind of just operating by itself, I'm sure there is human intervention, but like the, all those systems are kind of operating together. It's not actually you writing a bunch of code. It's, a, it's actually a bunch of reasoning systems working together to execute a problem. Now, when all this AI stuff came out, that was the dream that people were selling, that it would work like that. But people soon found out that it actually doesn't work like that. So most of your favorite AI companies and frameworks created workflows or flows, which is a deterministic way for a human like us to write these workflows that are using LLMs. But recently, OpenAI released their Python SDK, and the pretty much foundation of it is agent network as a first class citizen, which in their case, they have a bunch of agents. They have each agent has essentially a handoff instruction, which is how the agent will know that their task is done and to pass it to another one. And so that is some prior art there. Ingest has an agent network. Crew AI is agent networks itself. So it's not like this is a new concept. It just, I guess OpenAI kind of threw some hype to it. What do you think? Yeah, and now this is something we've been thinking about for a long time. And now we kind of have the concept of agent network. I'll have to say when we first started Mastra, we were anti-agent network, mainly because we didn't want the user to have this false promise that all this stuff's magically going to work, because it's definitely not. And even with agent networks, things don't always work. So we built workflows first. And workflows still are my recommendation if you want to have like control over your, your application. So we did our own interpretation of agent network. How it works is you have a routing agent, which is probably powered by a reasoning model. Like it could be O3 mini, it could be whatever you want, DeepSeek, et cetera. And its job is to evaluate the input prompt and then essentially delegate like a quarterback to all the agents that are in its registry. That way it may uh, call one or many agents in parallel, essentially to come to, up to a final result and then give it to you. So the best example is deep research. So yeah, that's agent network. So try it out. Let us know what you think. And we'll see you next time. Thank you.